Hey, Corey here down at Boundary this morning. Uh, just gonna take a quick video of this uh, Explorer for you. Uh, hope you guys didn't get as much of the rain as we did up here, but hopefully I don't eat shit and fall down as we uh, walk around this thing. So just so you know, yeah. Uh, so here's your fob, uh, unlock lock, remote start, tailgate hatch, and your panic, of course. We'll start it here right now. So just gonna do a quick walk around here and uh, show you all the features on this thing. Um, so first off, it does have the 360 assist, so you do have the front camera, as you can see right here. Uh, you do have the sensors in the front also. Walk around, so yeah. Like Sean said, we will swap out the tires for these rims and stuff like that. So power folding mirrors, of course. Rails up top, moonroof in it, like Sean had mentioned. Um, and then the back, here's probably has this also, but two clicks up she comes. Here we are in the back. So power back seats here. And down they go. Just a little cold, so. And then this side over here has got the mud flaps there. But they do go down. A um, little bit of storage in the back here. And underneath here also, which is nice. I'm just send that down so it stays down this time. And yeah, so there it goes. Uh, up top here, so you know your push button to stop it. You can push this down and push it again, and it'll stop wherever you want it to. Go back up. Uh, here's just the back seat, of course. And we could also just double click it and it will fall down on its own. Back seats here, uh, leather vented, and then uh, just a push button brings it forward for you, which is nice. Uh, here we do have the uh, console, that little console there. As you can see, it's not very, maybe even only like four inches tall. So definitely a lot of room for the kids to get in the back. Uh, here, dual climate control plus heated seats, back seats, plus all your charging options here also. As you can see there, uh, twin panel room roof up top, of course. Top of the driver's seat now. So power, seating, uh, seat memory here also. Uh, your tilt, your uh, back hatch opening here also, uh, your dimmers, your fog lights, just push this button in, uh, your manual transmission settings right here, adaptive cruise here, lane assist here, and then uh, settings for your volume and stuff like that, your cruise control settings here, uh, your phone settings over here. Uh, down here, so you do have the trash control right here, the hill descent here, your auto stop start here, this button here. Basically, if you're in traffic in Edmonton or somewhere like that and you don't want to hold your foot on the brake, you just push that button, you can let your foot off the brake, and once the light turns green, you just push the gas and away you go. Uh, heated seats, cooled seats, heated steering wheel. Uh, and you know, your different modes here, so just turn this knob and it'll basically give you all the different modes that this vehicle has. And plus it's almost out of gas, so. As you can see, different settings for your tranny there. So that's a nice feature to have. Uh, this does have park assist here also, and uh, 360 camera, as you can see there. So that's a nice feature also. More charging options down here in this little cubby hole here, so yeah. And uh, wireless phone charger right there underneath the console with some more charging options inside of it also. So a little bit of storage up here. So yeah, very, very nice car, SUV. And basically a lot more options than the uh, XLT and uh, MSRP is only $1,500 more. So a great value and a steal for this thing. So I will send it, I'll download this to YouTube and send you the link here shortly. And you
to have a look at it and also I will get the pictures of that uh, other explorer the seats in it and send that to you also and see what we can make happen all right thanks Ashley hope you have a great day and uh, we'll talk to you soon thank you bye